Well, I've started moving bees out. I got into my spring holding yard just barely. We left uh, a little bit of rut coming in. I had to climb a bit of a hill, but uh, the rest of the night should be good because we're talk they're talking like minus 10. So it, I should be walking on frost for the rest of the night. I'm gonna bring out another two loads. I'll try to get three out tonight and maybe three. We'll see how much energy I have. But I wanna get them out for the next few days because tomorrow's supposed to be nice and then the rest of the next week's supposed to be better. So I want them to get them out for next week. So it's a start. Okay, let's just take a little peek to see what we got. Ooh, that light looks good. You guys are getting hungry. Get some honey out to these guys. These guys are good for food. Do some cluster. Nice and calm. Nice and calm. Some steep frames there. Oh, I'm going to be all night if I just keep doing this. Good hive. Good on stores too. Decent. I've seen a whole lot of dead ones, but I guess that's what that thermal gun had shown me too. These are fairly nice looking hives. It all depends on how they uh, cluster after they fly and such. You know, whether they loosen up or, well, if it warms up, then they'll be able to do something. Here's uh, has a little bit of trouble in the front. Dead. Good. Get some honey on these guys. Oh, there's lots of weight there. What's wrong with that hive? Okay, so I gotta better get back to work or I'm gonna be all night here. Ah, just another row and then uh, try to get another truckload, two truckloads if I have enough energy. But seeing live hives, that's kind of motivating. So maybe I'll get two, uh, two more truckloads out. <laughs> 